a Chinese citizen journalist covering coronavirus just live-streamed his own arrest. Here's a summary of the article. A citizen journalist who was exposing the reality of life inside the Wuhan lockdown zone at the epicenter of the coronavirus outbreak was detained by China's security forces at his apartment in Wuhan, and the whole thing was captured on camera. Li is the third citizen journalist to be detained by authorities in Wuhan in recent weeks and was live streaming on YouTube from his apartment in the city when unnamed officials arrived at his door and stopped the recording. Red, here's how China is hunting down its coronavirus critics. China's security officials are showing no signs of slowing down in their efforts to silence dissenting voices critical of the regime and its response to the coronavirus. Red, China arrested a whistleblower who shot viral video of coronavirus corpses in Wuhan. Red, here's how China is silencing coronavirus critics in the U.S. since the outbreak began. China's censors have been working overtime to silence critical voices. The Chinese government's attempt to silence those who exposed the real situation of the coronavirus outbreak in Wuhan and other parts of China has created opposite effects, Patrick Poon, Amnesty International's China researcher, told Vice News. This post received a score of 64,973, with an upvote ratio of 94%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. What happened with that one YouTuber in Wuhan who said he was against the Chinese government and would continue to document till his death? He disappeared quite a while ago and was supposedly forcibly quarantined by the government because he caught the virus, but we haven't heard anything since. Chen Chushi is the name we're looking for. He was quarantined over 20 days ago and still hasn't been released. The big question is, if he's primarily forcibly quarantined for the virus, why has he been denied access to a phone or other forms of communication? The virus is typically fought off within two weeks by able-bodied people, such as him. So why the hell hasn't he been released yet after such a long time? Remember the name, Chen Chushi. Don't let the dictatorship make his name disappear, as they have done on their local web. If he never shows up again, they will just claim the virus took him. If, sadly he will never show up again, he's probably just chilling in a voluntary training center with all the other dissidents. I'm sure he's fine, just like Tank Man. Really hope he isn't too close to Tank Man. Tank Man looked to be about 30 in 1989 when nothing happened. This puts Tank Man at about 60 in 2020 which means that he is at higher risk of dying from coronavirus and we wouldn't want anything wrong to happen to Tank Man. S. Tank Man. You mean, redacted incident that never happened, man. Oh you mean the time the Chinese military had to hose up some awfully human looking paste down the drains in the center of a random square in China? It's just a fairy tale story mothers tell their children to scare them. It happened in Cinnamon Square. I admire the journalist's bravery and courage. Yes, I would not be that brave in the face of the state arresting me with no public accountability. Yikes. You say that now but imagine knowing time's up. You'd do anything in those two minutes of freedom you have left. That's a good point. If I knew no matter what I did it was game over. I'd totally want to post about it to the net. If you're going to be a martyr, you might as well do it to the best of your ability. I feel like Reddit should have a sub which archives videos that must be kept for the sake of democracy and the greater good. Some people enjoy no freedom of speech, and the least we can do is to preserve this kind of bravery and let the world know that there were warriors who fought against injustice. Edit, thanks for the awards. Kind people. There is, our, data hoarder and its related subs but I don't think any are specifically about politics. Although it's less about Reddit archiving the data and more about Redditors themselves doing so with just about anything they want to hoard. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.